What's going on, people? Neri Rodriguez here for Jersey Sports Zone. We're at Rowan University, where the best in South Jersey have gathered for the Talaferro Football Classic. These Southern All-Stars have much more than bragging rights on the line. They're out to show the rest of the state how they get down. If you're from the southern part of the state, this is the game you want to be playing in. Adam Talaferro, the former Penn State Nittany Lion who overcame a paralyzing spinal injury and started a nonprofit to help others do the same, who this one is in honor of. Tough defensive battle to begin. Nasir Bateman of Paulsboro with some cookies late in the first. That sets up a 45-yard touchdown from C.J. Bear to Michael Johnson of Timber Creek with 136 on the clock. Extra point no good. White with a 6-0 lead at the end of one. Midway through the second hometown hero, John Maldonado of Glassboro with a great grab to put his squad on the one. Next play, C.J. Barrett going to find Kingsway receiver Kevin Zenner for the TD with 826 remaining. Another failed extra point making it 12-0. A botched punt return puts Blue on the six yard line. White forces a fourth down and they get the stop as will remain at that score going into halftime. Blue starting the second off with some fireworks. Purvis Hatcher of Cumberland on a mission from deep in his own end zone, and he's out. Hatcher with a kickoff return giving his team life as they trail just 12-7 to begin the third. They would have momentum after that. Blue forces a punt. And the refs say White downs it on the one yard line. If you take another look very closely, tough call to make. That would be crucial because White forces a fourth down from inside the five. And it's a block punt from Shalik's Tyree Snipe. He recovers it and strikes gold as the lead is now 19-7 White. Following possession, Tariq Snee with some fresh cookies. He'll close out the third with his team up by 12. Ensuing drive, C.J. Barrett throws it up to Camden's Damon Rice. At 5'8", 150 pounds, he avoids two defenders, then hits the Jets and is headed to the crib. Rice makes it 26-7 in the opening minute of the fourth. White squad locking it down in the final quarter. Ryan Jennings of Eastern somehow comes down with this ball. Blue would score late in the fourth, but this one too far out of reach for a comeback. 26 to 13 is your final from Rowan University. White squad led by Timber Creek head coach Rob Hinson winning the Battle of South Jersey. Quarterback C.J. Barrett, your winning MVP. The future Rowan player will come into camp a few weeks from now with a good resume. He ends the night 14 for 27 with 199 yards passing and three touchdowns. On defense, Nasir Bateman setting the tone all game. The Paulsboro linebacker had a sack and an interception. Best part was he wasn't even supposed to be on the team. Afterwards, we caught up with Barrett and Bateman on their two incredible nights. It feels amazing to get this win, representing um, the White Squad for South Jersey. All these guys, we became, we became a small little family in the last four days, and it's just um, great winning it with all these guys. It's a blessing to even play this game because you get picked from everywhere. For me to even be, I don't even think I was noticed going into this game. I wasn't even supposed to be here, actually, because the running back from Pauls, bro, my boy, De'Ron Holloway, he was really picked to play in this game, but he declined the invitation. So then my coach, Glenn Howard, had picked me to uh, be the next one up to play in this game and represent Pauls, bro. I'm Nary Rodriguez, and you already know, it's Jersey Sports Zone. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.